My name's Megan. This is Kimber, it's my daughter. She's two and a half. <laughs> she is a handful. When she was just a little over two years old, she started experiencing symptoms of just a normal cold, um, runny nose, cough. It just progressively got worse. So I took her into the doctor. The doctor said, just a normal upper respiratory thing that's just gonna have to run its course, she'll be fine. But if she gets worse, bring her back. I ended up taking her to the ER and I knew something was not right. She was not herself. She couldn't breathe. Her chest was caving, her stomach was caving. She was fighting to breathe, really. So I took her back to um, the doctor's office. She said, I'm gonna call an ambulance because it's gonna be the safest thing for her. So it was definitely more severe than I think anybody anticipated. But as soon as we got to the hospital, they ran several tests and that's when they confirmed that it was RSV. We were finally able to see her progress and do better. Probably three days in, she sounded better and she was more interactive. I think there needs to be more dedication to RSV. The awareness is not there. It's there for a very short amount of your child's life. And then after that, you don't hear about it. No one talks about it. It affects families and children to, to a very extreme level. I hope that she never loses her sassiness. Her general joy that she brings to almost everyone around her. I just, I want her to have the best life I could possibly help provide her with.